In our studio, we have Sanjeev Gupta. Sanjeev is CEO of Realization Technologies. Realization has helped a lot of organizations around the world execute large and complex projects faster. Sanjeev is also a recipient of Lifetime Achievement Award. Sanjeev, why is project delivery so important? First, Kapil, thank you very much for having me here. It's a pleasure. Project delivery is about getting the projects done. Until the projects are done, they are just a cost. When the projects get done, they bring in benefits. And when the project gets done faster, not only does it cost less, but you also start realizing the benefits faster. Think of a factory project. You are investing 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 crore rupees in a new factory. Every day that the factory does not come online, production is not happening, your bottom line is getting negatively impacted by a few crore rupees a day. And the typical delays in these factory projects are not in days or even weeks, they run into months. So you can easily calculate the impact. And this is true for all projects. It's not just about the factory production, about hospitals, about roads, about bridges, about waterways. Every day that these projects get done faster, you start realizing their benefits faster. And we are excited about bringing our project delivery technology to India because we all know that infrastructure will be the lifeblood of India's growth. And if we can make any meaningful contribution in terms of accelerating the rate at which infrastructure gets developed, it would be an honor for us. But isn't this what a project management software is supposed to do? You're right. That was the promise of project management. In 1960s, when project management software was first created for the mainframes, that is what you thought. But those projects did not get done any better than the projects get done, that got done before that. Then in 1970s, 80s, you had new waves of computing, workstations, PCs, internet, and project management software has become more and more sophisticated. But what has happened to the rate of project delivery? With our project delivery, nothing has changed. It remains equally abysmal today as it was 50 years ago. So how does a project delivery system work? What is so unique about it? Yes. So if you look at project management versus project delivery, a project management system focuses mostly on planning and it does a pretty good job of planning. It provides you great decision support for planning. At the same time, only 10% of a project is about planning. 90% of the project is about execution. Execution is where the toughness is because once a project has started, you have delays, changes and disruptions that will happen every day. And if you don't have good decision support to guide managers through this execution phase, through the successful completion of a project, your projects will suffer. And this guidance can come in two ways, two primary ways. One is telling frontline supervisors what to do, when to do it. Second is telling executives and project managers what to worry about. So looking forward to see what is going to jeopardize the completion of your project, telling managers exactly what to expedite and where to intervene. So this kind of decision support logic is what project delivery system brings. And that is what makes it effective. I'm wondering if an organization is already in the middle of a project, already using a project management software, isn't it too disruptive to introduce a new system in between? Yes, it can be. And that has been the history of enterprise software. You bring in a new software in and you have to turn off the old system. You have to feed new data into the new system. You have to establish new business processes and you have to train people. Fortunately, with project delivery system, all this process gets uh, short circuited because first project management systems are not really getting used in execution. So you are really not turning anything off. Secondly, the project delivery system is working with the data that you are already collecting today. So there is no new data to collect. And finally, you are not asking users to change anything, managers to change anything. You are just giving them what they are lacking today. So training and setting up new business processes is not an issue. And a project delivery system for a very large and complex project, for example, building a new power plant or building a new factory, you can set up the system in about three weeks. Thank you, Sanjeev. Uh, we wish you all the success in India.